The Defence Ministry today lodged 14 more reports with the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission, MACC, over questionable projects linked to the ministry involving land swaps. There are now a total of 16 land deals involving over 1,000 hectares belonging to the government valued at 4.7 billion ringgit that are suspected graft cases. The Defence Minister's Special Officer, Muhammad Nasai Ismail, said findings on the 16 projects show the government lost an estimated 515 million ringgit due to factors including time extension of projects which were not completed. He made the reports only today after going through the extensive Auditor General's reports on the matter. Kebimbangan kita uh, ialah uh, bukan sekadar kerajaan kehilangan ataupun kerugian dalam bentuk uh, wang ringgit uh, di atas kegalan projek ini tetapi juga kita berdepan dengan ancaman apabila pembangunan tidak dibina berasaskan kepada keperluan strategik ketenteraan. Uh, jadi ia bukan sekadar merugikan negara tetapi mengancam keselamatan negara. In February, the ministry had lodged a police report to the MACC on two projects involving the construction of military camps and facilities in Paloh, Johor and Hutan Melintang, Pera. Muhammad Nasai is claiming that camps were used to shore up electoral support for both AMNO leaders. Also in February, Defence Minister Mohamed Sabu said internal investigations into the 16 projects valued at an estimated 4.9 billion ringgit found that at least 500 million was indirectly lost through their valuations.